Hi everybody, how you doing? I am doing good. I've been super busy uh, mixing paints. <laughs> but I've got lots of pretty, pretty colors. I'm like super excited. Uh, so yeah, I just have so many beautiful ones. I got this one beautiful one. I should put this one in there too. Oh my gosh. Light blue violet. It's a Liquitex basic. Beautiful. Um, should I put some of that in there too? Nah. Guess I won't. Okay, so I'm using these little bottles that uh, Catherine gave me. So I'm gonna just give it a shot here. <laughs> They're just little tiny pins. And they squirt out real fine, so it should be pretty, hopefully. And then it's not like a lot coming out at one time, so that'll be good for me. Anyway, yeah, that white violet would have been pretty. I think that I might. Give me of those bottles. Oh, she did give me another one. I'll fill this one up with some light violet, too, so hold on. Okay, so that should be pretty. These four colors with white. This one is the light blue violet Liquitex Basic. This is Liquitex Basic Quinacridone Magenta. This one is Liquitex Basic Prism Violet. And this one's Artist Loft Cerulean Blue. Should be pretty. So we'll see what happens here. Just thought I'd have some fun. Been wanting to try these since she gave them to me. So I have some white here mixed up. And I'm going to just pour it on here real thick. Hopefully that's enough. Actually, that's pretty thick too. But that's okay. I think it's okay. I can always pour more on there too. So yeah, I'm gonna have to cover my sides first. Cleaned out my tray too and everything. My cat's chasing bugs out inside my storage door. They should. It's so fun after you get everything done <laughs> while you're mixing cleaning your paint area and then you start painting that's how fun it feels right now to me all right good I think it's got a good amount of white paint on there let's do it See what happens. <laughs> Never know. Maybe I do need a little bit more white too. Come to think of it, really have to have a lot to flow it around.
so don't have any uh, silicone in here so we'll see what happens I'm smiling ear to ear doing this it's fun probably gonna look funny who knows I can't see it looking funny though such beautiful colors and being like buried underneath that white and maybe that white is too heavy too okay Get all, those bubbles. all right let's do it so let's take a look at it first not much to look at really guess I just have to start pouring it off. <laughs> Where did it all go? It's all buried in there. That's pretty though. Kind of neat. That'd be a really cool background. Oh man, that would be really neat. I think I just have to keep stretching it out a little. Well, I don't know where all the paint is. That white must be just too heavy. <laughs> what a bummer. Keep messing with this. <laughs> oh. Well, yeah, white. White dominated, no doubt, and it looks doesn't look it looks red from the camera, but that's pretty. I think it's pretty. You know what would be really cool right now? A balloon thing on it, maybe. You never know because it's in there. There's no doubt that paint is in there. Yeah, I wouldn't want to push it off. Okay, well, let's check it out. I'll torch it. <laughs> I don't see all the colors. I'm thinking maybe a balloon smash would maybe pop them out of there because they're buried under that white. White is very heavy. Very nice surface to give it some time. I'm not gonna rush things here, so I'll pause it and we'll just wait it out and see what happens. Okay, so it's really not doing anything. It is pretty though, isn't it? <laughs> you have to admit that's pretty. That'd be so pretty to put a flower string pull on here, but I have so many of them, so. Let's see, try something different real quick. Hopefully it'll be quick. <laughs> I'm just playing tonight. So I decided I'm going to use a little bit of my leftover uh, deep turquoise with this. So here we go. Let's do this. Let's go. A little bit. Quarters. 
And I might have to speed this part up. Right on, guys. <laughs> so did you notice that I started with the sides before I got to the, the puddles that I made? Because I wanted to see if there was anything underneath, and there was. Did you notice that? This is pretty. Oh, I love it. I really do. I love that deep turquoise in there oh my gosh it's so pretty oh my gosh so delicate and beautiful anytime you do a balloon smash there's always going to be a little naked areas but that's okay because that's what makes it really cool once it dries up then it's awesome might smash that one area this right here but I'm scared beautiful so there you go you can always turn something that's not working out into something beautiful yeah, it's gorgeous. So yeah, that I don't need to mess with it. It's beautiful. Okay, thank you for watching, guys. So I had to speed it up there. I'm sorry about that, but you know me. I don't want to take trying to go a little bit faster. And of course, but I really did like these because they injected it in there, and we just couldn't see it because the white is so heavy. It's like it's these are a lot of these are transparent too probably that light violet so it was just underneath of course we know it was because I deliberately put it underneath but it was there because I deliberately went away from those spots to start with but I'm just loving this one and then I put a little black in there Okay, I'll take a picture of it. Put it in the front of the video. You want to go look at it again? That's awesome. So thank you for watching, guys. Have a good weekend. And um, stay blessed and happy and positive, okay? And like, share, and subscribe. If you'd like to, that would be awesome. I'm really stoked with this one. It's so pretty. These are just gorgeous. Oh, my gosh. It's like, oh, man. Okay. Bye-bye, guys.